Yeah, good day. Welcome to our design and hotel continuations for Martinez Design. Someone come come to uh, my inbox and ask questions like whether I have stopped the development of the hotel. That you want to see the conclusion and everything like that. I was wondering, it's not completed yet, but I just like okay, the company with this hotel, as you have seen it, is a commercial building, it doesn't come to an end until the client is satisfied. And since it's like a client to us now, we want to work and modify it a little bit and see what we can do. So if you have not been subscribing to our channel, you are not subscribed before, kindly click the subscription button and at the same time can help us to share and like this because we always create a project on daily basis so now we have created some pool at this side we have created a lot of things and things like that so let us do a little bit wonder work upon what we what the person bring up sufficient now like here we have seen like uh, this uh, part the uh, the material for the ground floor slab here happened the quite different from this like this one is striking through we want to bring everything close to normal level because we are using this details so what we do click here and take the material for that uh, floor that you are using so aluminium 11 is what is it so you are going to change this particular one this particular this uh, this slab you click on it and you say edit edit type and you duplicate it so you duplicate that one so that because of the material you'll be able to choose it so from where you choose this one now so you're going to look for aluminium 11 so which is uh, this guy it's have been deposited yet so you say okay okay and okay everything will change we change to that Aluminium level, so the pattern has changed everything. I is using the same, the same confidential activities. Now, the next thing we want to do, I'm not changing topography, so we've been selecting that is not the criteria here. So I want to rotate again. Now I want to create something around here and create another thing around this place, eh? which is going to be what elevation. Eh, what is it called? You're going to enhance elevation enhancer. Now I'm going to call that. Then I will now bring a, what is it called? The name of the hotel to the front so that the little one you understand it. So the design of this hotel depends on okay, how clients see it. I'm okay with this. I want more of this. So that's how you do a commercial building. Commercial building does not have end until being executed and finally what being submitted. For the proper even when it's on site the adjustment and continuous is going to be that is why I like, like abandoning it for silly this element and preparity have been done for people to see so now what I do is that uh, I will go to my level 2 at the level 2 now I want to create a sweep as, uh, as I said a sweep as I want to create a solution which is of work so I'm creating components. So modern in place. I'm using wall. Scroll down. So wall. I'm using create that and say okay wall one fine. So I'm using this one from this point. Create extrusion here. So create this from this pattern. Start from there. Take it to like. Uh, 4,600 and the same way like 3,000 at the side so enter so as you have done that what you need to do is to offset this to 250 will be okay so you can just let 150 to know that it will be too bogus good so you we'll close this together now. We'll do the same thing here. And we'll say finish. At a 3D level. So 
so you extend this by clicking this and take it up it's okay by you fine it's okay by your design and your pattern idea which is purely interesting so you click that and change the material to the material that you know that okay it's okay by your so I'm duplicating this I want to check, check something else so I've signed this materials and say go to siding I always like siding but you can change that and choose something like this so when you choose something like this you go to appearance and go and change this to something bigger edit the image from the editing the image because of the rendering aspect you change this one to very big times 10 4000 by 4000 So you look more bigger and more bogus. So you say okay. Can you see? So you like this. So now what you do is that I want to create a sweep around this place. So click on sweep. So click on peak. So I'm stretching this outside the outside I'm using good everything has been snapped to one another I think they are in place to so click finish so when you go back to level 2 at the level 2 now you say edit profile the profile you edited here will determine how successful this aspect will be so this is a uh, hmm, bring something bogus into play because you are going to create some certain design in that level so when you look at it from the 3d what did you see good so you change this one the material category you can change it to something like aluminum, this white one. Good. So, or you change it again to, let's say, I want to use different color. Duplicate this and you say go to another material. You go to appearance library. Go to work off in a paint. And I want to use something like a yellow. Okay, let me use orange. So I prefer that. Good. So the orange is there. So by the time I'm bringing the lights into this, something reasonable will occur. So I'm using the same thing for this aspect as well. So say create. Okay, let me use because I want to use the same family for for this one. Click finish there. So select it. What was this? Uh, edit in place. So at the edit in place, I want to use the same uh, sweep. Model in place for the for the guy, and then uh, pick, start picking. Pick from here. Pick from here. And pick the outside. Click this. Go to edit over, go to level 2. Then from there, you select and design what you do fit. It's okay by you. There's any aspect of that can you carry light. So when you do that, edit again and select this and say change the material. You can use that particular one as well. So after you're done with this, click finish. Then you go to your three uh, camera and go and see the changes that you have made. Can you see a little bit of change has occurred in this place? So that is how you work on review. So I'm going to put the name of the O, the name of the building. Yeah, okay, let me put it here. Why light shining on it and things like that? So, how do I do that? I go to my 
elevate um, sites so because i want something parallel to that level to that place where am i seeing that wall from so i will create a section okay i'm using this particular section now but i think it's a parallel section to good so i'm using this section now to work it out so go to that elevation so here is what i want to do so what i do is that i click architecture so from the architecture you click model text so it says you should click play i'm going to select play here so i'm selecting this play so just i need to write is that light good hotel lights good hotel so i don't want it to be like that i'm going to space them by pull them down what i want you to write vertically So that is light good to that now we created the COK has disappeared. What happened? So that's it's missing. So what we have we create another one. Create and speak play. Select. So here you do the same way lights good hotel. So what we do press press So that's how you do to work on those object, uh, objects. Now, if you do not see this time around, then something is there missing. So place it. So come to set. What is issue with it? The issue you are go to your elevation okay control Y. The issue is from me is from the category of the model the model is not big enough or solid enough so what we do is that we go back and go and create it the way we have started so go to section section 2 yes so we go back and create model text click play So what is pick is a uh, plain picking is the issue here, right? Okay, just pick and do what is needed to do. Okay, model text is here to stay now. You click here. Horizontal and you see vertical, right? Apply. 
so here you turn the text and you click it to like we have said lights good return good so you bring this down to edit it if you want to So you see, click OK and see what has happened. Here now you have this and you click on, just rotate it to 90 degree. And bring this to place and delete this original one. So what this one means is that you are going to edit the text. Say OK and your own. Um, this particular guy is going to what left so everything will be aligned to that place and you increase the depth by changing this and um, change the material to something like duplicate it and we'll give it to something in a white form it's okay by you let it be align it you can change text the way you change everything it does not matter earlier if you don't like this this uh, change it to something that okay, is okay for you. Not bad. Apply. If it's okay, leave it. If it's not okay, leave it. If it's textile, if it's okay, these are the things you consider. So, like this, it says stylus, style. Good. So, you can use this. You use the, the textile by making it 450 apply see it's being reduced so i'm making it 500 this time around apply or you click ok so if you look at it from your you're going to see what you have done and you see so light good the fusion is here so that is how you do and that is how you work on your 3d formula so is there anything that you want to just make sure you send the correction and we do the whole thing for you by arranging it. So for here, the commercial building doesn't have an end until the client says, okay, we are bringing end to it. So for here, you can bring your lights to, to this place and things like that. So that is how it works. So we're stopping here now for the case of someone who make a request that we have never we abandoned it we not abandon it so you can continue working on your on it every day so kindly subscribe if you are watching for the first time and if not 